Why hello you amazing beautiful people and welcome back to another reaction video. Now we've been on a journey going all over the world listening to the best vocalists from Korea, China, the Philippines, America, everywhere and that has landed me in India listening to some of the best voices I've ever experienced out of any vocalist I've ever heard from Arajit Singh to Shreya Goshal and now all of you have been telling me that I need to hear Atif Aslam. So today Finally, I'm going to hear this guy's voice. For After reading the comments on my last video and all of you recommending that I listen to this guy, it's safe to say I'm a little bit excited to finally hear this guy's voice. So I'm going to keep this intro nice and short and I'm going to jump straight into my first time ever reaction to Atif Aslam. किस्मत में मेरी चैन से जीना लिख दे डूबे न कभी मेरा सफीना लिख दे जन्नत भी गवारा है मगर मेरे लिए कातबे तकदी मदीना लिख दे I've just got to say straight off the bat what a powerful voice what a powerful voice um I don't know the name of the instrument being used at the beginning but what an amazing sound I love how with Indian music so far it feels like there's such an experimental desire when it comes to creating music uh, like with with a lot of western bands and a western music it's so limited to like three or four different instruments and with indian music what i'm discovering so far is you'll use like a whole orchestra of instruments in songs and it just creates this absolutely beautiful atmosphere of music and i just saw that now and then and then a teeth came in and just stole the entire show with those powerful vocals incredible already oh, Tajdaare haram, Tajdaare haram, ho nigahe karam, Tajdaare haram, ho nigahe karam, ham garibo ke dil bhi samar jayenge. क्या कहेगा जहां हम ये बेकसा क्या कहेगा जहां आप के दर से खाली अगर जाएंगे ताजदारे हरम ताजदारे हरम I am I'm a fan already. <laughs> I'm a fan already, man. I'm getting emotional just listening to this. This, this, this whole world of music I've never experienced before. I can't believe it. I've been checking out all these vocalists. I can't believe it's taken me so long to listen to Indian music. For anyone who's new to my channel, I try and keep everything completely diverse. Check out so many different artists from all over the world. I do this all for fun. I don't make any money from my channel. I literally do this for fun. I listen to all this music from all over the world. And I can't believe it's taken me so long to go to India. Easily some of the most talented vocalists I've ever heard already. I can't wait to explore more. मारे हम आप 
के दर पे फरियाद लाए हो निगाहे करम वरना चौखट पे हम हो निगाहे करम वरना चौखट पे हम आपका नाम ले लेके मर जा ताजदारे हरम ताजदारे हरम Right, I've just got to say, is this the same song or is this a different song? Is this the same song or a different song? I was reading the lyrics as we were, as I was going through that one. It seems like quite an emotional, perhaps religious song. Uh, like the lyrics, very hard hitting, and, and um, I'm just. I'm just blown away. I'm just blown away. I'm just blown away. I'm so surprised. I love him. I love him already. I love him already. से कहूं ऐ रब के कुंवर तुम जान तो मन की पतियां दार फुरकत तो आए उम्मी लकब काटे ना कटती अब रतियां तोरी प्रीत में सुध बुध सब बिसरी कब तक रहेगी ये बेखबरी कहे बिग है दुस्ती दा नजर कभी सुन भी तो लो हमारी बतियां आपके दर से कोई न खाली गया beginning about about the instrumentals like i said i'm like as, as someone who i'm from the uk as someone who's like british and been raised on like british and american music it we do you're just like limited to the sound of instrument like like free instruments in a band and I, it's so refreshing to see this experimental style that like obviously it's not experimental to to indian music but it is to someone like me and it, just how well it works this whole orchestra of different instruments with different sounds and how well they complement atif's voice on this track and the reason i say that the indian vocalist i've been checking out whether it's atif or shreya the reason i say that he's indian vocalists that i've checked out whether it's araji atif or shreya the reason i say they're some of the best vocalists i've ever heard so far across the entire world is because in indian music it seems that these vocalists have a way of completely changing their pitch and their notes that i've never heard before and i can't even imagine beginning to learn how to do something like that with your voice the complications to be able to do what this singer can do with his voice I can't even begin to understand how it's even humanly possible. जब है फिजा मदीने में तजल्ली हो किया जब है फिजा मदीने में 
निगाहे शौक की है इंतहा मदीने में कौसर से पीने चले आई खुड वन ऑफ यू प्लीज डू मी अ मैसिव फेवर um i'm trying i'm following the lyrics i'm trying to understand as much as i can but i feel like there's much deeper spiritual meaning to this song that i'm not picking up can one of you please explain to me the meaning behind this song in the comments down below the deeper meaning behind this song it's absolutely be- be- absolutely beautiful i can't even speak i can't even speak i'm sorry if this is like a boring reaction i'm literally just feeling this so much just sitting here and going along with it it's the same with every single song i've heard so far from all these different artists it just gets inside of your your entire soul and you can't help but just feel the emotions of the song and you just get caught away with it it's amazing it's absolutely amazing i think in like my last reaction varaji i just sat there and you just get taken away like like you're floating on a wave and and it's amazing how vocally they can just f- make you feel like you're floating in air it, it, it's it's such a release from the stresses of the world indian music there's so much emotion and beauty in it i've never experienced anything like this before याद रखो अगर याद रखो अगर याद रखो अगर याद रखो अगर उठ गई एक नजर जितने खाली है सब जाम भर जाएंगे याद रखो अगर उठ गई एक नजर वो नजर जितने खाली है सब जाम भर जाएंगे ताजदार है मुश्किल है आका किधर जाए हम सख्त मुश्किल है आका किधर जाए हम आप ही घर न लेंगे हमारी खबर हम मुसीबत के मारे किधर जाएंगे आप ही घर न लेंगे one thing i've literally just realized it's just hit me right now i think the indian language whatever the, the official name for the language is but the language he is singing in right now It is a language that was made for singing. It's it suits singing so beautifully. It really does all the notes and everything and the accents. It just it just sounds so beautiful. It really does. It feels like this language was made for the deliverance of singing. It's like if singing was invented, this is the language that invented it. Mustafa, Mujtaba, Irham Lana, Irham Lana, Kaste Hama, Pechara, Dama Tu, Dama Tu, Man Asiyam, Man Aajizam, Man Bekhazam, Hale Nara, Pursatu, 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 Pursatu. Ay Mushtubhe Zum Barfisha, Pake Nasi Me Subhadam, Ay Charagar, Isa Nafas, Ay Moon Se Bhi Maare Gham, तुझको उसी गुल की कसम इन्नल तैयारी है सबा यौमन इला अर्दिल हरम बल्लिग सलामी रोजदन फीहन नबी इल्मोतरम ताजदारे हरम ओ निगाहे शौक की 
emotional get teary eyed just thinking about this I can't believe that it's taken me so long so long and I apologize so much because um because I've had people in my comments telling me I need to react and listen to all this Indian music I, I started this channel and this journey is literally a way because I, I I thought I had a really wide varied taste in music right I've always thought I had that and uh, I started this journey realizing I don't I don't have that. And I started listening to independent artists in the US, which then led me to independent artists in the Philippines, which then led me to Korea and then led me to China. And it's led me all over the world listening like f France and Bulgaria and, and, and Algeria and listening to all these amazing voices that, and, and different styles of music that the whole world has to offer. And if we limit ourselves to one sound, we're just going to miss out on this. We're only in, in this lifetime. We're never going to hear it. And I, so I just kept myself open-minded and, and wanted to experience all these different sounds of the world. And then it led me to India with, with, with Arajit Singh and, and, and it's just led me down this, this beautiful rabbit hole. And, and then Shreya Goshal, what an amazing voice. And Atif, what an amazing voice. Like I said, I'm so impressed with Indian vocalists and how they can just glide over different notes. It seems like with, with a lot of vocalists, they, they hit on one note, right? They're singing and they hit one note and they raise that note. But with Indian vocalists, they, they, they hit like five at once and, and they can like go back and forth between them. What, 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 what I've seen so far with like with, with, with a T, for example, with this song, it's, it's so impressive to listen to someone just singing a verse and every word is a different note. Like I said, I can't even begin to imagine how someone learns to do that. How do, how do they learn to do that with their voice? It's so incredible. The talent in these vocalists that I am listening to is so incredible. I, I Like I said, I apologize if these reactions are a bit boring. I'm just sitting here smiling the whole way through. I'm just so taken aback by the music. It's such an emotional, it, like in the best possible way. It Like Indian music just has this way of just piercing your soul. Every single time I sit in this chair and I listen to any of these artists, I just feel like, uplifted in a way happy free relaxed it's is so it's so beautiful this music really just is so peaceful i can't think of a better word to describe what i'm listening to than peace i feel completely at peace listening to this music i feel like every worry that i have is gone and in that moment when i'm sitting here and i'm pressing play and i'm listening to these songs i'm just taken away from it i forget there's a camera i forget i'm recording I forget everything. I just feel like I'm I'm just taken away from the stresses of everyday life. Does that make sense? It's absolutely incredible how something as simple as music can can do that. The complexities in, in Indian music just takes all the simplicity of music out of it, if that makes any sense. There's something truly incredible about this world of music, and I'm so looking forward to hearing more artists just as talented as, as the ones, as Araji, as Atif, as, as Shereya Goshal, because I have no doubt there are so many I'm missing out on, and I can't wait to listen to them all. This is going to be one of the most interesting and best musical journeys I've ever been on. It's absolutely incredible. If you guys want to join me on it, then just make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any videos, because I'm so, I'm so looking forward to hearing more Indian artists that I'm just missing out on. It's, it's, an, it's an incredible world of music and I feel like the whole world is missing out on this. It's, it's mind-blowing. It's just a, it's just a place full of so much talent and beauty. It's incredible. I hope to one day see them all live because I can imagine in live it's even more incredible. 
anyway, I'm I'm just my mind has has been turned to mush after that. Um, I don't even know what to say. Absolutely incredible. Atif has made one incredible impression. I would love to hear more from him. So please let me know what songs or videos you guys would like me to check out next by Atif. I so want to hear more from this man. What an incredible voice, incredible talent. Such a passionate, emotional and spiritual song as well. With, with very profound lyrics. I so want to hear more from this man. An incredible voice. An incredible voice for the whole world. Anyway, let me know what I should listen to next. And thank you so much for watching my video the whole way through if you did. And for liking and subscribing and supporting my little channel here on YouTube. I hope wherever you are in the world, you have an absolutely amazing, beautiful day. And as always, my friends, you right there will see me in the next video.